want to be real. Like, that's all I really want. It's for you to be the real. So you don't have any qualifications uh, no, for No, I'm just kidding. What makes you? I'm just kidding. Okay, okay. So people always get this confused. People never know when they're talking to someone, when they're dating someone, or when they're really in a relationship with someone. You want to know why? Because all of you crazy people have multiple meanings. Like nobody has the same. <laughs> people don't have the same meanings for all of those titles. Like one definition. Nobody has it. And it's absolutely ridiculous. Maybe we at had, this point we didn't have so many names. Either you're together or you're not together. I mean that's. That's stating the obvious as far as what a relationship goes. You've already communicated to each other that you want to see no one but each other. And you would like to be in a relationship. You've already stated that you want to be in a relationship. You're monogamous and committed. That's what that is. Point blank period. There's no ifs, ands, or buts or ways around it. Now people mess it up all the time having these effed up relationships. These effed up open relationships That's where you can dumb. swing and First do whatever all, the heck you everybody want. Everybody can't get in the same cookie jar at the same, same time. Exactly. That's how hands get stuck and something has to break and get cut off. We don't have to cut people. Well, I mean, you're going to have to cut, cut some off. people off. Because, I mean, like, if you keep going into the cookie jar one too many times. Your ass has to go. Honestly, if your, your ass, ass goes into the cookie jar. <laughs> Come in the cookie jar. What? Anyways, if your ass goes in the cookie jar one time on my account, your ass is finished. You don't get no second time. You don't get no third time. This ain't no baseball game, nigga. You struck out in the first round. I will Mayweather knock your ass out. I'm confused. Done. Are you saying that cheating is is gonna be your your first no, class but trip out I of the I guess that's not the same cookie jar I was talking about. I was saying that. And that's that shit I'm talking about. Nobody knows. Exactly. Me. Everybody's not talking about the same thing. That's the issue. I was saying that, you know, you can't invite everybody in. Like, okay, say you invited somebody into your cookie jar. But then your relationship was open. So, you know, he's the owner of the jar. But, but he's sharing it with the co-owner. All the people are being invited into the cookie jar. Like, that can't happen. Everybody it, can't get cookies from your jar. It's just not, like, then it becomes, you become a sports team. That means people own pieces of you. Right, I can't be, like, that's just too much. And tell me if that doesn't sound like not what you want to be. You want property? To share you want to be a piece property? Of what you got? Want to share I don't a piece of so. that penis that you have? Share a piece of that vagina that you got? You don't want to share the vagina. You don't want to share the cookie. Exactly. You Stop sharing. Share, you don't want to share the fruit either. Because if she was like, oh yeah, I'm messing with this so, old so, dude and this guy back in the day. and blah, 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 you wouldn't like that. All sensitive. In your emotions. You wouldn't like that. You ain't going to be down for the sharing. Exactly. And then they'll be quick to drop you, but want you to stay. If they share right. themselves, um, don't be sharing. My name is Caress. It's not give, share. Like, and I ain't shared them like almost my whole life. And even yeah. if I did share, you got the worst part of the cookie, baby. Okay, that's horrible. But I'm just saying, like, <laughs> my mom will tell you, like, even as a kid, like, if you wanted my snack, I had to eat part of it, most of it first, and then give you whatever was okay. left over. That's horrible. I'm a very giving person, but I'm not sharing my cookie. Like, it's a cookie. It's basically meaning whenever I'm done with it, you can have it, which means pretty much I'm still not sharing at all. Because I'm done. I mean, in... Don't share the cookie, okay? Don't share his cookie. Don't share your cookie. Don't share cookies. Share apartment things. space, <laughs> right? house share space, else. gas money. Like, there's so many diseases and things out there that you can catch nowadays. Sharing really isn't worth and it. And there are way too many people on the download to be really trying to share your uh, relationship with other people. At least if you got a tight lock on everything, not even like a lock. Like if you 
if you and your person have a good enough understanding where you're both honest with each other, at least you know what's going on. Like when stuff will happen, you'll be the first to know. Exactly. But don't go into being single and getting to know people, which is talking to people. People, I want you to understand. Getting to know people before you decide that you might want to have a relationship with them is talking to them. I mean, y'all are just talking. Friends, your friends, you're just trying to get to know people. Friends, you don't even have real benefits. At all. You have the possibility of benefits. Like, you're thinking that it might be good. But really, is it going to be good? Have you... Have you checked out the package? Yeah. And then even if it is a nice Read package, is the delivery print. good? Who's gonna be shipping that bitch? Read the fine print. Well, you sign yeah. all of them contracts. Take your time. Read every inch of it. Like really get to oh, God. <laughs> really get <laughs> really get to know someone before you decide that you're gonna settle down. Because that's really gonna make the whole of the total relationship. And once you decide it, after getting to know somebody a little better, I mean- Don't share it! Even after you've gotten to know someone a little better <laughs> and y'all have not really gotten, y'all haven't decided to be monogamous, but you decide to be a little more exclusive, which means you probably select more of your time for this one person but there's still windows of opportunity that you have open that's dating that's what dating is keeping your windows open with the possibility of something serious happening once you stepped in once you've removed almost all of the gray areas because it's impossible to remove all of the gray areas but once you've removed well, almost all possible though like if we Define the relationship. Why is there a gray area anymore? I don't understand. I'm talking about not like in the relationship type. No, I'm, I'm talking about in personalities, like because you'll never truly know everything about somebody until like you've been with them for years. I mean, you can take years in dating, but I just want to let you know, for me personally, I'm not gonna wait for your ass. I think that we're just proving the point all over that nobody has the same definition. Nobody does. Because I've got to just work with just my definition, you will be happily ever after forever. Just define or don't define. Like simple as that. Either you're together or you're not. That's easy. I don't need to know if you're talking, if you're dating, blah blah blah. I mean, Either but people together, need to not. know because people meet people and then after two days think that they're dating somebody that they barely they don't you don't even know his middle exactly. name. So if you, if you don't know his middle name, why y'all dating? If you define it, then there's no confusion. Like, if you just say, this is this, and this is not this, this is that, this is not that. Like, that's it. Just be honest. honest. If you don't want to be together, don't be together. Don't. And that's all. Be real.